Hello, my name is Miller Shavas, I'm the founder of Adroid Surgical. I thought I'd talk to you about our Bois Bougie, uh, which is a, an American made product, which is a, an airway adjunct that we use in difficult airway scenarios. Um, I think most people are familiar with how a bougie works. This is a 70 centimeter bougie, uh, which has colored safety bands on it. It's the um, only bougie that has that. Um, the dimensions are like 23 centimeters up to the green band, five centimeters and 15. And it's symmetric, so you can use either end. Uh, you'll notice that it doesn't come with a coup d'oeil tip, but you can bend one, and you can have whatever angle that you like. It has a memory, so you can use a coup d'oeil tip if you feel that you have to. Um, we came up with the, uh, the Bois Bougie to help facilitate intubation using the V-scope. So the V-scope is a Bougie-enabled intubation device. So we look under direct vision, we see the tongue and the epiglottis and then the notch of the interretinoids under direct vision, get a grade one view, and then I pass under direct vision to the bougie. And the bougie stops at, at the green band here, at the upper teeth or the gums. And you're probably wondering why um, you want to have those colored bands, because in an emergency situation, um, people are sort of moving quick and I don't think that they're going to look at the actual numeric markings on the bougie. They're probably more receptive to having a very simple colored band that they know when to stop once you pass the vocal cords. And the airway is essentially the same when, when after you reach like 10 to 12 years of age. It's approximately uh, 14, 15 centimeters from the front teeth to all the vocal cords and about 11 centimeters below the vocal cords to the carina where the, the trachea splits off into the right and left. Bronchi. And the last thing you want to do is advance it too far and have this go down the right main stent and potentially cause tracheal, bronchial, or even you know, lung parenchymal injury with the pneumothorax, or have it not far in enough that it's sort of sitting just above the vocal cords and when you pass the endotracheal tube over it, it's going to miss. Whereas if you know that you have your green band at the, <coughs> at the upper teeth, it's going to stay exactly where it's meant to stay when you pass the endotracheal tube over it. So that's why we have the uh, Bois Bougie. This is not just for the uh, V-scope, it can be used with any laryngoscope. Um, you know, the dimensions of the airway are the same. So say we're using the Macintosh uh, laryngoscope and we have to do a Bougie intubation. So I'm, I'm looking down here, and, you know, the, the tip of the, the Mac has to go into the follicular, so leaning against the teeth a little bit, and then I see a, my grade two view, this is just an airway mannequin, and then here we go. Same thing. So the green is gonna be at the upper gums. I know that we're in past the vocal cord. The, the airway situation is stabilized because we know that we've got access past the vocal cord. Uh, I'm going to sort of quickly put this endotracheal tube over it, but at the same time I can see my colored band and I'm not going to dislodge, pull this thing out or advance it further. I keep it exactly where it needs to stay and I pass the endotracheal tube over it. That's a safety colored band with the Bois Bougie. Thank you.